Welcome to Infigyan friends. Today in this video we have one very very interesting question from algebra. Here we have square root x square plus 7x minus 4 plus a square root x square minus x plus 4 equal to x plus 1. Then it is said to find the value of 3x square plus 14x. So let's get started by writing here. Required expression is e. Now I will check our equation at x equal to 1. What will happen to equation at x equal to 1? LHS will become square root of 1 plus 7 minus 4 plus square root of 1 minus 1 plus 4. And in RHS we are going to get 1 minus 1. So 8 minus 4 is 4, square root 4 is 2. Plus 1 and minus 1 will be over, square root 4 is 2, which is equal to 0. So at x equal to 1, 4 is equal to 0, which is not true. So we will say for our equation, x cannot be equal to 1. Now we will use substitutions. Let's say first square root is a second square root is b. So we will write our first equation a plus b equal to x minus 1. Now x cannot be 1. So we can say a plus b cannot be equal to 0. Let's say this is our equation number 1. Now we are going to write here our substitution a is equal to square root of x square plus 7x minus 4 and b is equal to square root of x square minus x plus 4. So from here we can write a square value will be equal to x square plus 7x minus 4 and b square value which will be equal to x square minus x plus 4. Now we have to subtract b square from a square. So we will change the sign here. Plus x square minus x square will be over. So in LHS we will write a square minus b square and in RHS, we will write 7x plus x, 8x minus 4 minus 4 minus 8. Remember, x minus 1 is a plus b. This is our equation number 1. Now we will take 8 common from here and we are going to get x minus 1, which is a plus b. Let me write here. a square minus b square is equal to 8 is common in the bracket x minus 1. Now our first equation was a plus b equal to x minus 1. x cannot be 1, so a plus b cannot be equal to 0. Now here I can write a plus b using equation 1. So we will get a square minus b square equal to 8 times a plus b. Now we will use difference of two squares formula. So we can write here a plus b times a minus b in left hand side. In RHS we have 8 times a plus b. Now we have condition a plus b cannot be equal to 0. So we can divide both sides by a plus b divided by a plus b. So we will cancel a plus b from both the sides in the numerator and denominator. We will get a minus b value 8. Let's say this is our equation number 2. So we have two equations a plus b equal to x minus 1. This was equation 1 and a minus b equal to 8. This is our second equation. Now we will be adding both the equations. 
to get the value of a. So I will add both the equation. I will get 2a in the LHS and x plus 7 in the RHS by adding 1 and 2. Now we have to divide by two both sides. We will get a value x plus 7 over 2. Let me write here a equal to x plus 7 over 2. Now our substitution was a equal to square root of x square plus 7x minus 4. So from here a square value was x square plus 7x minus 4. Now we have a value x plus 7 over 2 which we will apply here x plus 7 over 2 whole square equal to x square plus 7x minus 4 or we can write x plus 7 whole square over 2 square will be equal to x square plus 7x minus 4. Now we are going to multiply both sides 4. So let me write here times 4 and this side also will write times 4. Now 2 square is 4 so we will cancel 4 from the numerator and denominator. We will get x plus 7 whole square equal to 4 times x square plus 7x minus 4. Now we will be using a plus b whole square identity. Let me write equation here x plus 7 whole square equal to 4 times x square plus 7x minus 4. So we will write x square plus 2 times x times 7 14x plus 7 square 49 equal to 4x square plus 4 times 7 is 28 x minus 4 times 4 is 16. Now we will take all the terms to right hand side. We will get 4x square minus x square. Then we will write 28x minus 14x. Then we have to write minus 16 minus 49 equal to 0. So 4x square minus x square is 3x square. 28x minus 14x is 14x. Minus 16 minus 49 minus 65 equal to 0. Now you can see this is our required expression E. So here I will write required expression E. So we can write here E minus 65 equal to 0. So from here our answer is expression value 3x square plus 14x will become 65. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.